Thank you for staying with us. Guilford Technical Community College is offering camps this summer for teens ages 13 to 18. And this gives them a snapshot of possible career paths. So the Titan Tech summer sessions will run from June 17th to the 21st and June 24th to the 28th. Most sessions will cost $75. And here to tell us all about it, we have Mike Lawson, an Associate Professor of Advertising and Graphic Design at Guilford Tech. Good morning, thanks for being here. Hey there, how are you guys? Great, so let's first talk about the meaning behind Tech Titan. Well, Titan Tech, uh, the GTCC mascot is the Titan, and so our logo includes a, a Titan mascot, and so it's just sort of a play on on, uh, on the college, uh, college, you know, look and feel and the, and the name that we put in there. Titan Tech, my bad, I mixed <laughs> those two words up. No problem. <laughs> well, what do you hope kids take away from this kind of camp? Well, I mean, the idea of the camp, you know, we've been doing this since 2019. We were one of the first colleges that were, that were you know, putting this forward. And the idea was to give young people an opportunity to, you know, explore possible careers or, you know, different things they might study in college, you know, rather than waiting until they turn 18 and head to college, you know, why not go ahead and, and get teenagers thinking about their futures? And so we've come up with um, 15 different subject areas uh, across two different weeks. So students can really um, explore a lot of different stuff while they're here. It's being taught by... Um, award-winning faculty and industry professionals in a you know a safe super fun environment and you know it's built to really be an exciting week obviously we want them to have a great time and love being on college campus and um, you know it's, it's been great so far and to be honest I've seen a couple of a couple of the Titan Tech campers are now students out here and so I've seen them in classes oh that's awesome and we want to highlight just a few of the many sessions you are providing for these teens one is called exploring wearable art what is that about Sure, that's a new one this year, and it's inside of our um, our fine art program. Um, and so that one is really working with clay. Um, and so it's the idea of different techniques on sculpture and clay, and the idea is building um, masks out of clay and different materials. And then those things are um, are fired in a kiln. And so it's it's the entire process from starting to work with the materials to you know final um, revision and 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 creating that final piece that they can then pick up and take with them. Wow, awesome. So that, that, one's brand, that one's brand new, so everybody's really excited to see what comes out of comes out of that one. I'm sure. Well, mm -hmm. it sounds like this one might be returning. We're seeing some pictures. The first responder to the rescue session. Can you speak more to that? Correct. That was the one I was I wanted to sign myself up for that <laughs> one. It was it was the idea of exploring um, uh, careers in firefighting uh, with police officers and with first responders, um, um, EMTs and, and ambulance uh, workers and that sort of thing. It's the idea of seeing how those people would interact you know if, if you know if some kind of event happened you know the first people on the scene they're going to you know go through their tasks and their jobs and the next people are going to come in and, and do their part and so it's it's this idea of letting students try out you know in a in a mild or safer way uh you know what those what the job will be like each day in each of those first responder careers awesome and if you could tell us about this technology themed one cyber sleuths and then if we have time, how about the culinary classes that you offer as well? Okay, uh, so Cyber Sleuths, um, it's basically the idea of uh, digital forensics and cyber crime. So obviously we're all very interested in um, keeping our information safe and, and how that sort of thing works. So it's the idea of um, exploring the way hackers get into our uh, computer systems. Um, they'll be talking, you'll be using industry standard tools um, to analyze hard drives and mobile devices and sort of see the inside of um, how uh, law enforcement and different um, agencies would be um, attempting to track down and uh, prosecute uh, cyber criminals is the idea for cyber sleuths. So that one's, I'm really interested in that one, but maybe because I'm getting older, so I'm suspicious <laughs> of, of devices, but um, that one's really going to be fun. Um, and then culinary is, you know, that's our, that's definitely our most popular camp. That's the one that people are generally clamoring for. And it's inside of our culinary program, which is, you know, a national award winning program. Um, so it's baking and cooking, um, all these different um, facets of the culinary in, uh, industry. And so students come in and they're wearing the full on, you know, uh, chef wear. They have to wear the correct uniform. And they learn all the safety procedures for working with um, knives and the different equipment inside of the kitchen. And to be honest, that group, uh, they come out of there having eaten an awful lot of delicious food <laughs> and delicious snacks. So every camp on campus tries to somehow magically end up over near their building at the end of the day to see if there's any leftovers. 
I would too, it. Mike. Yeah, and thank <laughs> you so much for going over all of that information and for speaking with us this morning. Well, sure. Again, the first opportunity for these camps runs June 17th through the 21st, and then at June 24th through the 28th is the next round. 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. for all of these. Students can apply and register for one or both weeks. Just head to gtcc.edu for more information.